Nikki Curtis getting the flu shot I have for about the last 10 years is all about results. I haven't gotten the flu in 10 years. She's in the minority. New figures show in 2011, 52% of children and only 39% of adults were immunized. But it's a new year and experts believe we're looking at two new flus. Every year the CDC looks at what the most common strains are that they see coming um, from other parts in the world and we try to target our flu shot to cover those most common strains. And this year there are a couple different strains um, that we did not see in the previous years. So last year's flu shot won't cover you this year. Doctors don't know how bad this winter's flu season will be, but they are certain getting a flu shot has never been easier. The flu mist is another option for people who are afraid of needles. It's indicated for anyone from the age of two up until 64. Um, it does have some live virus in the vaccine, but it's been inactivated, so it cannot cause the flu. There's also a milder form of flu shot available for people ages 18 to 64. The intradermal only goes under the skin a couple of millimeters. It's a very, very small needle. It was supposed to be the ouchless version of the flu vaccine. Health experts encourage everyone to get vaccinated to limit the virus and lower the risk for vulnerable populations. As for Mickey, she doesn't need convincing. My husband, he did get the flu. He didn't get the flu shot. That's why. And now there are pain-free ways to avoid a painful illness. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.